Hello everyone and welcome back to our channel. In today's video, I'll be showing you how to add a video to your Squarespace website in 2023. Adding videos to your website can enhance users' engagement and provide valuable visual content. So, if you're using Squarespace as your website builder, we'll guide you through the process of adding a video to your Squarespace website. So make sure to stick by, let's dive right into it, and let's get started. Before we start with this video, make sure to watch us from now till the end, so you have full experience. First, let's just go and access the website editor. Open whatever browser you're going to use to follow the tutorial steps with. Here in my case, I'm actually going to use the Brave browser, and of course in your case you can use any other browser that you could possibly have or you prefer on your PC. Once you do so, make sure to go to this URL section, and simply go and type square squarespace.com and hit the enter button. Once you do so, you'll be taken to the home page or main screen of Squarespace. If you don't know much about Squarespace, you can always scroll down and read more information about it. You'll be able even to see like the products and a lot of other stuff, resources, like whatever you want. And of course, if you have an account, you can always go and log in into your account. But if you don't, you can simply click like on get started to create an account for yourself. For me, I'm just going to access my account dashboard because I'm already logged in into my account. And from here, I'll simply have to access my website editor. So I can, of course, add the video. So as you can see, that's going to be my website. Of course, for you, if you don't have a website, you can always go and create a new one. Go like to the Squarespace dashboard, click on create a website here. And from here, as you can see, you'll be able to answer some questions which will help you create the website depending on the template that you want. Or if you don't want to, of course, you can simply choose something random and keep skipping like the steps. So for me, I'm just going back here and I'm going to my website, as I said. And of course, if you create your website, you'll be able to add the pages or the links of pages, depending on the template that you choose. Uh, do some designs, commerce, marketing, scheduling, asset library, analytics, profiles, settings, and help. So for me, I'm just going to this website, double click on it so I, I can access the editor. Here, let me just go and delete this. I don't need it at the moment. And of course, for us, we'll have to go and add a video block. Of course, if you don't have any section first, you can simply go and click on add the section. You can go with add, add the block section if you want to, a blank, sorry, or even a save section if you have some. Or you can simply go and choose some of the sections that you already, already have here. For me, I already have a blank section here that I already added before. And now I'll have to go to the top left corner and click on add a block. Once you do so, you will find here a video block, which is going to be the fourth option or the second option on the right. Click on video, and as you can see, this will create a square for you that you can make as bigger or smaller, depending on whatever you want. And of course, you can place this wherever you want also. Double click on that, and as you can see, this will open this pop up for you. Here, you'll be able to add a video, but the video should be 13 minutes max. So as you can see, the video storage uh, is just going to be 13 minutes left. And you can even go and enable this custom feature image. But as you can see, I cannot do it at the moment because I'll have to upload a link a video to add a custom feature image. So if you click here, I can upload something from my PC or select something from library or even add it from a link uh, like YouTube of video if I want to, if I don't want to upload something from my PC. For me, I'm just going to go with upload the files example here and let's just go with this and let's say I'm going with this video. So here, as you can see, I'll have to wait a bit until the video is uploaded. Once it's done, of course, I'll have to go and choose like a featured image if I want to. I can just let it as it is, or I can choose the featured image depending on whatever you want. So let's just wait for the video until it's finished the uploads. And of course, as I said before, you have like uh, options to upload the video. You have the option to upload the video directly through your PC. Uh, of course, the format will be of the video accepted is just MP4, MOV, and AVI. Just keep that in mind. Because Squarespace uh, offers or accepts a variety of video formats that I just said. It's just those three. Or if you prefer like, uh, to embed a code from an external platforms, like uh, you'll be able to do so as we see, see, say, say before or so before, uh, such as YouTube or Vimeo. 
and of course you'll be able now to customize the video settings so once it's uploaded let's just go and customize the other settings as you can see you'll be able to enable this option of muting the video so if you don't want like people to hear uh, the sound of the video you can simply go and mute it and of course they can always go and unmute the video you can even enable this autoplay option so when the video uh, finishes example if you have like a small video when the video finish will just keep repeating itself you can even go with loop video so if you have like the video on mute uh, or not on mute you'll not be able to auto play oh sorry so the auto play will just start the video uh, without person clicking on it but this loop it's what will just keep repeating the video sorry i just made a mistake so if you didn't mute the video you'll not be able to auto play it but if it's not muted you you will not be able to auto play so you can mute the video and auto play it and of course you can even enable this option to loop the video so it will loop infinitely there's even this player control so you can like let all the player control or minimal like player control like the quality uh, the sound or you can simply none you will not have the option of the users to control uh, the video like uh, if they want to uh, i don't know to have the quality or to change the quality or change the sound or play back the video or do something like that so you can give or the, uh, the player control or you can give none or just minimal which is just the sound and quality if you want to so depending on whatever you need you can even go here and add the description i'm just going to add the test as an example as you can see it's added here you can even go and place it whenever you wherever you want you can do whatever you want with this as an example and of course now uh, as you can see uh, the video is added so i can give it a custom featured image enable this option so you can add it and as you can see you will be able to add an image uh, but it should be just a 20 megabytes click on that and as you can see you'll be able to select it from library or upload the file click on upload the file it's going to choose something from logos here and let's just go with this best buy as an example uh, image so as you can see uh, that once the image is uploaded it will be shown is showed uh, here and uh, like on the video but before it's played once it's played this will be hidden and the video will be played without any problems so uh, before of course finishing you can simply click on save and once you save you'll have to go and preview the site before publishing it and then you'll be able to publish your website if you're satisfied with this video so if you reached this point this video, congratulations, you have successfully added a video to your Squarespace website in 2023. So whether you choose to upload the video directly or embed them from external platforms, Squarespace provides the flexibility and customization options to showcase your video seamlessly. Thank you for watching, and we hope the, your website becomes even more uh, captivating uh, with the additional or, or videos. So thanks for watching again, and I'll see you in the next video.